it's all coming back to me. Celine Dion stuck in my head. Whoa! I am back in Tucson, Arizona for a really good ride that I did with my buddy Patrick up ahead four years ago during the 50 state shred. It's Mount Lemon, Bug Springs to La Milagrosa. Yeah. We did a self shuttle. My van is at the bottom, his car at the top. 39 degrees in the parking lot at the start. <laughs> yeah. Oh, get ready for the herky jerky. <laughs> I had to go back and look at the date of the video because I wasn't sure when I'd done this. I didn't know it was right before the pandemic, January 2020. <laughs> right around 6,000 feet right now and the last time we did this it was ice and snow at the beginning section nice oh Woo physical so it's a little bit nicer today <laughs> 14 miles ahead of us, 1,500 feet of climbing, 4,500 feet of descent. A recipe for amazingness. Oh God, <laughs> wet, slippery rock, recipe for disaster. Wow. Nice. <laughs> that was freaky. Yeah. Woo -hoo -hoo. Oh. oh, yeah. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Speed check. Wow, nice. <laughs> oh, got it! Oh, oh man, so good. love it. Patrick rocking the pivot Firebird. Whoa. The Arizonans, especially the Phoenicians, are very loyal to the pivot brand. Splash zone. Whew. Yeah. <laughs> Whew, my feet are nice and wet now. Patrick was saying the full lemon drop from the very top is like an eight hour ride. Holy moly. I don't think I'm interested. We're going to probably do four hours today and that'll be plenty. <laughs> Heavy duty. As we start to get lower, you'll see all the whoo, ecosystem change, the flora, from high desert to low desert, and everything in between. <laughs> yeah, the first time I rode with Patrick was out here. He made me an offer I couldn't refuse. Why don't I have an easier gear? 
Oh, that's it for me. Whew. Oh, maybe because my battery's dead. <laughs> maybe that's why. I could use a little break. <laughs> okay, confirming it's this battery, not the switcher pod. There we go. This part on my derailleur is still broken. I have the extra piece, but oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna let it roll for a little while. Oh, up and up and no, no, no. <laughs> they have at it. <laughs> After you, my friend. It's time to get into a little hike a bike section and a hydration break brought to you by the fine sponsor of today's video, Element. You know I spent years and years looking for that perfect hydration drink and finally I found it with Element. It tastes fantastic, doesn't have a pound of sugar, keeps me fired up but doesn't make me all jittery and doesn't mess with my stomach. The Element Thesis is out with sugar and in with salt. They believe that most people, especially healthy, active people that get out and sweat a lot, need more salt in their diet, not less, to feel their best. The plan on every ride now is to drink a full bottle of Element before I even start, just to get me ahead of the game, then take a couple of bottles of Element on the ride, and the most important part, if I'm still feeling pretty wrung out after a ride, have another bottle of Element. I can't tell you how many times I would go on an epic, giant ride, feel pretty good, make it through the ride, but several hours later I would get that crazy headache that I couldn't nail down, and now I'm positive it was dehydration. The Element mission is to restore health through hydration. I drink it on every riding day, and then some days when I'm not riding, I drink it too, especially if I feel a little headache coming on. I think if you try it, you're gonna like it, but there is a zero questions asked return policy on the Element website. You are taking no risk to get your first taste. And right now, when you place any order on the website, you'll get a free eight pack sample pack with a bunch of different flavors so you can try each one. That's only available through my link, D-R-I-N-K-L-M-N-T dot com slash B-K-X-C. Start out with a box of citrus salt. I think it's the best, nicest, mellow flavor that you can drink day after day after day. And then with the sample packs, you'll kind of see what other flavors you really like. So make sure you go to drinkelement.com com slash bkxc to get that offer how old are you 34 okay so if i start singing step by step that's like new kids on the block it's a little yeah, no, I know. okay I'm 34 but i got an old soul. there you go <laughs> <laughs> hanging tough <sighs> oh. okay we had a nice little break took my jacket off and now, I think we're gonna get up to a little nasty feature that I may have walked the last time and I may be walking this time. <laughs> to the hoodoo! <laughs> Dry up those brakes. Oh yeah. Okay, let me look, let me look. I was about to just go for it. I'm taking the easy way out. The more I look at it, because this is what I was gonna try to do right there. Boom! <laughs> no squeaks. So annoying. What the? Full contamination. <laughs> Hoodoo. This is where we took our first group photo. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Right on the hoodoo. Oh, this is cool. Okay. Come on, usually the brakes burn off quicker than this.
Oh, so cool. So unique. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Woo. Square Edge Alley. Oh. Somebody's gonna get a cacti today. Oh, doing that with the saddle up. <laughs> nice. <laughs> that was great. I love how this bike just floats. <laughs> more travel, more better. Always. Hero dirt. Oh. <laughs> I'm always a big fan of riding something new, but riding something old when you know it's good, you can't beat it. Oh man. Hot stuff. Woo. Oh. Nice job. Smooth. Hey. <laughs> oh. Tires are taking a beating. <laughs> that sounded like a slice, <laughs> but you're good. <laughs> yeah. It's an abusive relationship. Holding on for dear life. Man, it's so confidence inspiring when I pull up a little and then land into the rocks and everything feels good. Probably 26 PSI, which is a little low for my style of reckless riding. And this is just the start of the rocks. I think they get way worse on the next section.
Endless jank. Okay. Whew. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> so good. Yeah. Fever pitch. Fun time. Yeah. Oh no. Slow down, slow no, I, I did too. Gear management. So this was a prison camp during the Japanese internment in World War II. If you want to learn something remarkable, Google Gordon Hirabayashi and read about his story. Learn something new and maybe I'll see you on the trail. I've got Italian heritage and my grandpa told us the story visiting his grandparents during World War II in an Italian internment camp in Calistoga. And I've done like a cursory Google search and I couldn't come up with anything. So I need to do a little more uh, research. Patrick was just saying how we can see where we just were. It's way up there tucked in the back and him and his girlfriend have done the race across Arizona or the ride across Arizona, kind of a big bike packing uh, ride race. And they'll be somewhere, you know, hundred miles away from the next destination and see the mountains in the distance. And it's like, okay, we got to get there. And then eventually after eight hours of pedaling, <laughs> you're there. Patrick's girlfriend, Carrie, got sick on the last attempt. So they're gonna have to try again this May. Basically start at the California, Arizona border, go all the way to the New Mexico border. Ooh. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh man. Oh, that's a good win. The only way you get into shape, getting uncomfortable. Yeah. Oh yeah. I had to pick up a few squeaks and creaks after all this little fine particles in water. <laughs> That was a hit. <laughs> it's, oh, so sharp. <laughs> I'm not sure if I hit the tire and it made a weird sound if I hit the derailleur again. Feels fine. <laughs> I got into a Humpty Jumpty thing. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Patrick was saying, this is the kind of ride you only want to ride with like two or four people on because the bigger the group gets, the slower the ride goes. <laughs> it's an all day affair. Nice. <laughs> I thought that was gonna get me. Ooh. Trail one needs to invent the uncreakable headset. <laughs> <laughs> Heidi hole. <laughs> All right, heads up. Good on this side. <laughs> Survivors. Nice little sign back there that said, trail maintained by Torca, the Tucson Off-Road Cycling Association. Wow, nice. Oh. 
And, <laughs> oh, not for me. Oh, <laughs> I was able to stall and reposition. Oh, oh God. Oh, I want to stop so bad. <laughs> not doing it. Oh, <laughs> dang it. <sighs> you are, oh, 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 oh. Right. you made it a little further. Oh, that's such a, <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't count as getting hit by a cactus. <sighs> you know, the rule is first one to get punctured by a cactus buys lunch. <laughs> All right, <take> away. <laughs> Now, of course, I'm gonna buy lunch. My fearless guide. Oh man, I cannot imagine doing this in the spring or summer when the temps just skyrocket. Oh God. Nice, dude. <laughs> I'll see you on the trail. Oh, that took just about everything I had. Oh. oh. Hope everybody on Patreon is enjoying the extended cut. Oh God, <laughs> big rides like this always have big videos. Oh, that's a big turn. Oh. For three bucks a month, you directly support the channel. It's an amazing thing. It's the whole reason I was able to go full time with YouTube. I've got a giant archive of hundreds of videos. Oh, this looks now, <laughs> especially if you're still stuck in the trainer for a couple more months Whew. inside snowed in. And even if you're not stuck in side snowed in, if you ever use the trainer, people love watching the extended cuts while working out. I'm basically the best Peloton coach in the world. Yeah, I'm going to take the lead. We'll see how long this lasts. <laughs> oh, almost locked him up. <laughs> oh, I remember this. I also remember finishing this ride and being like, I don't want to ride anything else but this type of stuff. Why waste my time? Woo. Woo. Doing anything else. Oh, so sharp. Patrick aired up his tires a little bit more for this section too. A smart man. Whoa. Gotta modulate. Try not to slide. <laughs> this is it. <laughs> oh. oh no. Oh man. Scared myself on that. How much can you let the bike roll? Oop. <laughs> spoke hit maybe oh cool breeze okay rest the hands three seconds <laughs> not so smooth but it was fast <laughs> I was pushing it Cactus Jack. Truth or Consequences, New Mexico. Couldn't see it. Oh. Oh. Ooh. Hold my breath over those rocks. Yeah. Oh. Chunder down under. That was awesome. 
put on the pogo stick. God, that felt great. Oh, hola, bacas. Uh. Hola, hola. Hola, hola. Disculpe. <laughs> Get them angry enough, they uh, they will use it against you. People always ask if I'm afraid of bears. I'm way more afraid of cows. Every bear I've ever seen ran away immediately. That was real good. Oh. This is the classic spot where Patrick ripped his pants last time. <laughs> and Tim had some duct tape to tape him up. <laughs> and just as he was pulling his pants down, some hikers came. Ha <laughs> ha! Whoa, that thing! I'm gonna break it off so it doesn't get the next person. <laughs> that was so jarring. <sighs> Cause he kind of came out on the pedal. I'm like, oh, what, something hit his bike. And then boom. <laughs> Little trail maintenance. Woo! -hoo. Oh, I love that style. Feels like a lot more than 1,500 feet of climbing, but it's uh, worth every second. Wide open. Mila Grossa. Very divisive comments on trail forks <laughs> about how much people hate it or love it. That's usually my type of trail. Oh yeah, I remember this goofy thing too. In this economy? <laughs> yeah, wet tires, wet brakes. Excuses! Oh, slap in the face. Let's see if the brakes have dried off yet. Oh yeah, the big saguaro cactus. Oh God! <laughs> Invisible. <laughs> That's what I get for leading the way. my phone in my front pocket which is probably a bad idea usually on the real jank stuff I'll put it in the bag but you can fall on the bag just as much as fall on the front pocket <sighs> Woo cow patty <laughs> Thought I had it. Oh man, nice. Smooth. Ah -ha 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 -ha. 
<laughs> into a hole, into Ooh. another hole. <laughs> wow, excellent on that one. Woo. Oh, boot scoop boogie. Oh, that's so ugly. <laughs> the OTB forest. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Exactly. Lose your mind. These left turns are no bueno. Oh yeah. It's all coming back to me. Oh. Celine Dion stuck in my head. Whoa! Cliff side. Whoa. <laughs> yeah. Boy. Survived it. Survived. <laughs> yeah. Nothing good ever came easy. Ah, <laughs> I looked over. That cactus looked like an animal off to the right side. <laughs> Had me going there for a second. Woo, yeah. Straight down. Oh, <laughs> oh man. Confidence inspiring. Those hits just look like holes to me. Now I'm getting used to it that I can just dive the front wheel right inside. Crazy. More travel, more better. Oh, that was OTB Central. Fought it off. <laughs> nice. Oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> I remember that section very well. Ah. Yeah. Oh. Awesome. Yeah, I remember that. Wide open slab. Fun friendship fitness. <laughs> I live my life by the 3 Fs. No problem. Yeah. Ooh. Family too. They just aren't in the videos as much. Oh, that wetness makes me so suspicious. <laughs> Traction control. Perfect. Oh God. Got it. <gasps> Ooh, yeah. Ooh. <laughs> creaky, creaky. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Awesome. Howdy. Uh -oh.
Is this even possible? I see on that right side, looks like a huge shelf. Yeah, sure. sure. All right, one, two. Oh, that one's perfect. All right. Oh yeah, it's possible. <laughs> My foot got caught under the rock and the rock moved. Over here. <laughs> oh. Wow. This is like my favorite type of terrain. Minimal trail maintenance. <laughs> Getting close. Can't celebrate too soon but no big uh, scratches no punctures <laughs> I'll keep my mouth shut oh god hesitation <laughs> oh, man you fall on those things <laughs> Looking for grip in all the wrong places. Nice. Oh, man. Good stuff. <sighs> yeah, that was great. <laughs> full chunk, full force, full fun, and now, hopefully the keys. Oh yeah, and I gotta make a little room for your bike too. Whee Shuttle math, never gets easier. So that was just what I needed, a step up from the last ride, and then the next ride, Sunset Ridge at Hawes, is gonna be a step up from this. So I needed a little in-betweener to get me ready and rearing to go. Now I got a nice little two hour drive back to the Phoenix area. Get this video edited. I'm working hard. I'm getting these things going. Do me a favor, go ride something new and maybe I'll see you on the trail. Didn't see anybody on the trail today actually, except for hikers. <laughs>